Hello, welcome back. This is Lolly, and I want to share my setup for my 2021 planner. This is a traveler's notebook that I've made with all custom dimensions. The theme is creativity, crafting, creating, and you will see why as we flip through it. So I want to do a flip through. I have an entire series for everything in here. So you can look down below for that link to all the videos in this series and let's get started. I made my cover out of craft text and I am using, and again this is a custom cover, this is a custom button closure that I created and it's one of my original ideas so let's open this up. I also have a charm that is removable and it's all like little craft items and paint and etc. I like to put my word for the year in my cover and so my word for 2021 is renew and I used heat transfer vinyl which you can do on Craftex. My first insert is right here, my paper collection. I'm using two actually, one is uh, I heart crafting and one is I'd rather be crafting. This is one, um, a cover that I created, an insert I created with calendar pages that I created and I will give you a link down below to the actual page, uh, the actual download, which is a free download from me where you can download this calendar. You have to hand write in your numbers and your months. I offer the Sunday and Monday start depending on how you like yours. I have a little pocket here and I have this wonderful washi tape that I found in my set and it's this turquoise tape measure and I made this paper clip here with a tape measure bookmark. This is a vintage cloth paper uh, tape measure. I have used some stamps here and there throughout my um, throughout my pages here just to give you an idea. I also used washi on every uh, other just basically every other page there's a sheet of washi here. There you can see where I have tied up my calendar page. And this is the end right here. Okay. That's the end of it. This is my next insert is my brain purge insert. This is another uh, download that I have created and this one is available in my shop and I will give you a link down below to that download. I have my little llama magnetic bookmark here. So that's my brain purge pages. There's the inside and I have some of that washi right there as well. These I have not stamped on. That's beautiful. My next insert is actually two. It's this one here which is a pocket folder and this one here which was a store-bought insert that I went ahead and recovered because I didn't like the the cover and it didn't match my theme. So on the inside of this cover we have this pocket. These are, um, this is a product piece right here. Paper clips came on it and I thought it was so cute. And I was just gifted this for Christmas. It says his kingdom rules over all. Sorry for the glare. I just think this is so pretty. I love this collection. I lined the inside as well and this is also a stamp. I, I went ahead and put one thing in my journal and that is a scripture that I really like. This paper clip, um, I had just a teeny bit of trim left over from this so I just wrapped it around the paper clip and glued it in place and it looks really cute from the outside. I have a couple of punched stars but that's it here. And then here is the other side of that pocket that I made. The pocket could stand by itself as a separate insert, but I wrapped it around this because I didn't have enough elastics. I used a journaling cards to make this little flip notebook there. Again, all the supplies are listed below as well as the links to the video. This is really pretty. And my last insert, I decided to make a junk journal insert. So let's flip through that. Got 
graph paper and all the stickers from the collection. Tiny little paper clip, those are in my shop as well. Those are Doodlebug. That's the crap. Vellum. This one I had journaling cards and I just left them connected instead of cutting them apart and sewed them in that way. This was from the 12 inch paper pack. Um, you know, a lot of times there's something that's so long you can't really get it into your um, projects. So I was able to just fold it in half. This is an envelope and it is sewn into the center of my, um, of my junk journal. So the ties where I sewed it are right inside there. And this lovely llama paper clip is, I will give you her link down below. She uh, sells, uh, her name is Jessica and she sells uh, embroidered, custom paperclip designs in her Facebook group. Another one of those mini paper clips there. I just think this paper, everything came together so well. I love the colors. I love the paper. And I think this cover really, the color of the cover really worked well with it. And that is the back right there. So I have plenty of room to expand. You can see I haven't even taken up all of my spine space there. And since it's a wrap, I can always go through and add in um, more and it won't make my, my uh, cover not fit. It'll all fit because this is a wrap so it adjusts as you go. Thank you for watching. I have loved this project and I am so looking forward to 2021 for many reasons, but one of them is that I look forward to using this TN.